Hello everybody, welcome back to Mob's World. You may... Whoa, hey you penguin, you stay in there. I don't know why you're trying to leave. It's a beautiful little nature preserve for you. Anyway, as you may recall, when I was enlarging my garden here, I stumbled upon a cave system that I looked at for like two seconds before being like, oh, I need to get back to work. So in this episode, I want to take a look at that cave in a little more depth. See what kind of treasures are down there. I would like to have... I don't have any wood. Wow, that's amazing. I'm going to have to take a quick run over here and grab some wood. Uh, just in case... How did you get out of your cage? I have been having nothing but trouble with animals lately. Goats sneaking out. My reindeer all got out somehow. Which I don't even understand because I put a glass roof over them. Nyan Cat's been gone for a while. It seems like no matter how many times I catch animals and put them in their cages, they just keep escaping. Um, I honestly don't remember where that cave was. So I'm just going to have to do some digging to find it. Was it over here? Maybe it was. Ah, there it is. I feel bad for just destroying my floor like this, but... I do really want to get in here and see see what there is to see. Now, I remember there had been a skeleton in here creeping around, as skeletons are wont to do. So I shall take care to have sword in hand. Ooh, some metal. That might even be good metal. Was that silver? It was silver. Though, honestly, I don't know what silver can do that's so great, but it's better than tin. Alright, going down. Tin, useless. Coal, sure, I'll take that because I actually can use it. You know, like torches and cooking things down. Useful. Um, a very dark spot that has light coming in. Or water flowing. Oh. This connects to the outside world. This could be a secret secondary entrance. I just want to know where it goes. Why can't I get into this water flow? There we are. Oh, interesting. Well. Very interesting. A natural cave that connects from the outside world to my zoo. Is there any benefit to this? No. Other than some easy to grab minerals. I think those are both tin over there, so I won't even bother with them. Um here this is where the good stuff is. A little bit more silver some iron and it goes down now one thing I do dislike is the water flow here but I guess that does actually kind of have its pros this keeps me from getting hurt as I fall and it pretty much provides me with a very easy way to get out so I can just swim up through the water stream just like that and I don't really have to worry about having a climbable pathway. So, you know, it's got its benefits. Plus, um, you know, it slows me down. So if there's a mob that's trying to kill me, uh, I'm kind of stuck. I had no idea I had chat showing. Totally my bad. Okay, what's here? 
It just keeps going down deeper and deeper. Let's open this pathway up to, you know, let more water flow in. And water actually is flowing in faster now. Ooh. Ooh, I like... Oh. Man. I'm like directly under my zoo. Interesting. I was just getting excited too, thinking that this cave went like forever and ever. Well, not quite that far, but much further than I was. And then I hit the end of it. It's like, oh, well, I guess that's not really the biggest cave ever. But there's a lot of goodies here, so I won't complain. All right, well, here's the thing to check. Let's change our map to radar mode. Wow, there are caves all over the place. This world is literally swimming with cave systems. This ends here, but... It connects up. Someplace. It connects. Like I can tell I'm heading towards another cave. It may be a little higher. Okay, didn't see anything up higher. Let's try a little lower. That's probably dangerous. I could fall down. It's got to be right here. Hmm, well... Let's try going straight out. I don't even know if I'm digging through anything. Ooh, some metal. Ooh, and some other metals. It's gotta be right in front of me. I mean, just, just look at the map. It shows it being right here. A big pocket. There's also a big pocket to this side. Which I thought for a second I fell into, but I did not. Alright, well, where's... Where's this pocket meat? There's some dungeon systems this way. I don't know how I'm going to find my way out. This is not a good spot to get lost. But on the upside, there's always the home command. And I just found tons of iron, so... Ooh. Have I just... Nope, that was just a dark spot. Man... I mean, it looked like I was right there. Like I was on top of it. But no, it just, it keeps going, but it never meets. What is the deal here? Why is this not? Where does my cave meet with this other cave? That I'm like directly under here. Ah! I should just give up. But there's so many, so many goodies down here. <laughs> okay, well, I should have met that other cave system by now. And I haven't. Which would lead me to believe that I'm not going to. So, I guess it'll be the old home command. And I totally just hit all the wrong buttons there. I wanted that. Alright, well, the chest's still here. Oh, hey, there my deer are. Let me get those suckers back. 
His chest still sitting here. I don't know. I don't know where it came from. I don't know whose it is. <clears throat> I don't know why I have it. But it's there. Didn't I just see another one? Where was he? Oh, it's a bear. All right, so I got two of my reindeer back. Let's go ahead. Oh, off camera, I went through and... Wow, everything's pretty much all grown up. I threw a bunch of foods around in there. Did a little planting and tendon. Um... Um... I think they were the... Yeah, because they had the... They had the roof. There you guys go. Stay in there this time, please. Actually, I should go here. So I can throw this stuff in your furnace. What do I have? 37 iron, 15 copper, 16 tin, and 10 silver. And 38 coal. Not a bad haul. Not a bad haul at all. I'll go ahead throw the glass in there, and that in there, and the string in that. Uh, I didn't have a chest for cobble. Yeah, but it's full. Well then, I think I will just throw that out. And I'll take that back. That I'll throw out. All right. Well. I don't know, it's too late in the day to go romping off to uh, start a new adventure. But I do want to visit some of those other biomes and just do some exploring. There's a the frost biome, which I had mentioned two episodes ago. I think this elephant wants my bread. Sorry, buddy. It's, it's not for elephants. People only. And, uh, yeah, there was just some crazy animals out there, and I want to see what they need to be caught so I can start getting some other animals in the zoo. So, that will be next episode. I may just spend the night getting all these nodes processed and taken care of. All those ores need to be smelted down I got some food stuffs here needing cooking and that'll wrap this episode up and then tomorrow we'll go to spawn and we'll visit some of these diverse biomes and see what we can find and maybe get some new animals for the enclosures here and with that thanks for watching guys I'll see you next time